I'm the hottest round. I told your mother, y'all can't stop me now. Listen to me now. I'm lasting 20 rounds. And if you want me, then come on, get me now. Hey everyone, it's me, Psychedelic Babe, and welcome back to today's video. Now, in today's video, I'm going to show you a couple of things because I'm in the middle of setting up the new tank and there's a few things that I need to do before I set the tank up and obviously I want to go through them all in a video with you first. So the first thing we're going to look at is the filter. Now you may remember my unboxing, there is a card up above for you to go and check out if you missed it. And here are the four trays that I got inside. Now I've been reading the box that I got with the Crystal Profi E1502 Green Line filter and there's a certain way of doing it to their specification. Now, I was gonna modify it to the way that I usually do my filters, but because this is the top tray, unfortunately, I can't do what I wanted to do. So, we're gonna do it the way JBL have recommended me to do it. So, in the, this section, we've got the JBL bio pellets, and in these two sections, we had just the gloss. So we're going to take the center pieces of one of these out. So if you look, you can take the two center pieces out. Now I'm going to keep them in because obviously they're going to add towards the filtration. So we're going to take them out and we're going to take the two out of this tray as well. So we've now got two trays that look like this. Now. In the package that I got of JBL, I also got this product, which is the JBL Bio Natrix. Now, this removes nitrate, it's the algae nutrient, and it's a biological filter material. It reduces algae nutrients by means of nitrate removal. It halves the number of water changes that you need to do. You just insert it into the filter chamber and refill it once it's used up. It lasts up to six months and it serves as a nutrient for nitrate degrading bacteria, which is purely biological, and it has full water stabilizing effect. Now this one box does 200 liters, which is ideal for my tank. So we're gonna open it up. As always, with every single JBL product, you get a JBL leaflet. So I'm gonna keep that to one side and I can always refer back to that. So now that we've opened up the box, this is what you'll get in. So we're gonna use them and we're gonna pop them inside one of the filters. So that goes in there, it goes in there like that, see? Now we did get two boxes of JBL. So I'm not gonna overdo it and put it into this one as well. I'm gonna fill this one with filter floss. So I'm gonna have my bio pellets, I've got my bio bulbs, I'm gonna have filter floss, and then we're gonna have the sponge in the top section. So the way I'm gonna put it into the filter is, obviously this is the top section, so this has to go at the top. Then I am going to do this section underneath. Then I am gonna have bio pellets, and then I'm gonna have the floss at the bottom, like that and then that all fits nice and neatly back into the filter and we fill it up with water, attach all the pipes and it's good to go. So there's the first part of this video. So we'll move that out of the way and we'll move on to the next piece of equipment that I'm gonna be using in the tank. And that is the JBL ProTemp S200 heater. So we're gonna take a look at this heater. It's a safety heater and it's got a nice little packaging and as always our little booklet so we'll put that to one side because we already know how to use all that so once we've got the heater out as you can see it's just a bog standard heater very nicely done yeah all your coils are inside and it's got a uk plug on it which is good now with this you get the bracket and you just simply slide your heater inside and it's as simple as that and you just plug it in and you go now this is the pro temp 200 
and this does up to 300 litres, it does a 120 centimetre tank which is what mine is. It's got a four year guarantee and it looks really good. So I am now going to go and put this into the tank and then I'm going to put all my filter together and I'm going to set the tank up with water. Now once I've done that and I've actually put water into the tank, I'm going to quickly move on to these JBL products. This is the Bitapol and this is the Denitrol. Now the Biochapol, this is simply, it's a bit like Aquasafe but it's JBL's version and this basically is just a conditioner for your tap water. It makes all your tap water safe. It's really, really easy to use and it says that we should use, if you have to turn it upside down to read it, it says it's simple to use 10 mils for 40 litres. So mine's a 200 litre tank, so I'll be using 50 mils of this and you just put this in and it takes all the nasties out of your tap water. So your tap water is fully safe for you to use. Now, the Denitrol, this is the aquarium starter, so I'm going to put this in because this allows me to add fish to the tank straight away. Now, that's a little hint for you because tomorrow I am getting some fish. Now, I'm not going to give away what fish I'm getting, so you're just going to have to stay tuned. Make sure you stay, stay subscribed to my channel so you don't miss out on the big reveal tomorrow when I show you the tank. I'll go through a little bit more of how I've set it up, what it looks like, and we'll introduce you to the new fish. So I hope you like this video. If anyone's got anything at all to ask about any JBL products, please do feel free to check out all the links in the description box below. And my email's also there if anybody wants to contact me regarding anything they've seen in any of my videos. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, share, and don't forget to drop me a comment below. I love reading all your comments, and yeah, it's nice to hear from you all. So I hope you all have a great evening. Thanks for watching. Bye.